Hello there, YouTube. It is your boy B3. Back with another kicking comic book haul video. Today, we're looking at some pretty cool stuff. First up is a manga. First up is a manga. It is Kamen Rider Kuga Volume 4 from Stonebot Manga and Titan Manga. Very cool. I will get to reviewing all this Kamen Rider Kuga stuff soon. Uh, right now, I'm uh, kind of obsessed with Kaiju Number 8. <laughs> Those reviews will be uh, coming as well. Oh, they'll be coming. Buckets. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. That's so stupid. <laughs> but they will be coming because, uh, you know, I read all that ancient hero stuff. Speaking of ancient heroes... Ultraman Tiga, which is also a kaiju book. This is Ultraman Tiga number 8 of 10, which is a book I've been looking for. Uh, I have the first several issues in a trade, but uh, I need the rest. Cannot find them anywhere. Uh, and I found this at Half Price Books for 2 bucks. Awesome. Beautiful. Look at that big old Tiga riding in on the missile Dr. Strangelove style. You gotta love it. Speaking of Subaraya... Half Price Books also had this beautiful virgin cover for Red Man. I have all the Red Man trades, but I've never seen a single issues anywhere. And finding this beautiful virgin cover, uh, which means it doesn't have any of the text or anything on it, for two bucks made me very happy. I just had to pick it up. Red fight. Red, 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 oh, fight. Also, we have this variant cover for The Phantom, uh, number 21 from Moonstone Comics, which is part one of five. Uh, of a story and a grid jumping on point, according to the comic. Uh, but this is kind of a black and white variant cover. Had to pick it up. Uh, I thought about flipping it, but I think I just want to keep it. It's a really cool book, and I really like these pulpy heroes. Next up, Bracula, issue two, also from Half Price Books, for $2.50. And this was there shortly after it came out as a used book. So someone turned this in real quick. Uh, and, you know, I love the Universal Monsters. It's one of my favorite franchises of all time. And Bela Lugosi is my favorite actor of all time. So I had to get Dracula issue fucking two. You know I did. You know it. Next up, Black Adam, number one. This is a one-shot comic uh, that comes with the Black Adam Page Punchers figures. I believe it's the same comic and the same cover, whether you get Black Adam, John Constantine, Superman, or Batman. I got Batman and reviewed it. Uh, I do want the John Constantine also, but I'm probably going to pass on the Black Adam, even though I wanted him for a while. Same with the Superman, because I think they've released that body with brighter colors and a smiling face now, and I would much rather have that. But yeah, it's a fun little one-shot about Black Adam uh, trying to be more heroic and working with the Justice League. And then there's a lot of, like, vertigo-y, Justice League darky stuff in it with, like, the rot and swamp thing, and I didn't expect that. I really didn't. Uh, but that made me happy because I'm a huge Swamp Thing fan. Huge fucking Swamp Thing fan. But yeah, this I probably will sell because I had, I'm not really interested in keeping it. I'm going to keep the Batman figure, but I don't really want to keep the comic, so I think I'm just going to sell it. Uh, and then last up, this I will keep, Venom, Lethal Protector. I've read this issue in the past. I've read nearly every Venom comic that exists at this point. Um, and I had this as a kid, specifically this version, because it came with a Toy Biz Venom action figure I had as a kid. And I wanted that figure back in my collection, so I bought a sealed one because I wanted him complete with his stand, and a lot of them have little broken off bits. And I wanted the comic, too. Uh, and I'm just going to keep the comic on <laughs> the mm, back of the packaging here. See, that's the Venom. I have reviewed it, if you want to check it out. God, it's a cool figure. I always wanted those as a kid and never got them. Had that one, though. Anyway, this issue, Venom Lethal Protector number 6, is really cool. But I'm just going to keep it on... Uh, this cardboard here. It'll just stay like that. Anyway, a quick recap of this short haul. Venom Lethal Protector number 6, the action figure version. We have 
the Page Punchers Black Adam number one, Image Comics Universal Monsters Dracula issue two. We have the Phantom number 21 variant from Moonstone. We have this beautiful Virgin Redman cover, as well as Ultraman Tiga number eight of ten from Dark Horse. And for our manga, Kamen Rider Kuga volume four. So that's it. Thank you all very much for your support. Please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Check out the cool links down in the description below, Facebook, Twitter, etc., as in uh, and I'll be seeing you all next time. Bye for now.